I'm the regional coordinator for Vet Sports, which is a 501c3 nonprofit organization to benefit veterans, to help bring veterans back to civilian life through sports. 22 suicides a day is what it is right now due to PTSD and feeling like they're not welcome, they're different, because they leave and they have all their arms, all their legs, all their toes. They come back and they're missing stuff. People stare and it's hard for them to understand. And so through Vet Sports, you bring them back to other guys just like them. Vet Sports started three and a half years ago. It's, a, um, it's ran by three injured vets um, from Iraq and Afghanistan, Purple Heart guys that started up to help bring the uh, military men and women back to civilian life through sports. Oh, let's go, come on Taylor. Bring it in, bring it in boys. Let's, let's get some. Go. Hey, go back to your dugout. Woo. Go, go back, sports. Sports on three. One, two, three. They can relate and helps them to be able to open up and, so to speak, get let the skeletons out of their closet. A lot of stuff they hold in because people can't understand what they've been through unless you've been there. And so it gets them together. It's it's a way of meeting, um, networking the different branches together to show them that, you know, we're all still one. What I get out of it is the joy to be around these guys, to hear their stories, just impressing me. And to me, they're, they're the heroes. You know, they, they took the ultimate sacrifice going overseas and doing this, and it's a way for me and my family to get back, even though I am active duty. It means a lot. I've, I've lost a lot of friends um, in Iraq and Afghanistan, and so it means a lot coming from a military family. I have been on the phone with some of them talking when they just needed to vent, talk, um, to just cry, um, whether they want to cuss me, cry, talk to me, they want to fight me, you know, it's just whatever they need at the time, I'm there to, to provide and do for whatever I can. and. Um, also with me, um, I do a lot of prayer for them. Uh, a lot of them will call me and they, they just want prayer. I have a guy locally here that got in vet sports. He did uh, two and a half tours in Iraq and he has severe PTSD. And I talked to him, met him. I started a softball team here in Jacksonville for vets. And uh, his wife told me that I probably saved his life, that he had been contemplating suicide. And it's just the fact getting him on the field now. And as of today, he's out here on this golf course swinging clubs and he has not missed a game. He's happy. His wife said she's never seen him this way he's up playing with the kids so for me that's personal testimony i mean it's it's for me it's just unbelievable to know that maybe i kept the number 22 down today